let's look at this set maruti udyog limited manufactures only five models of cars namely z uh, namely zen wagonar st maruti 800 and omni following observations are made for the years 2015 and 16 okay we have break up of units produced and we have break up of revenue then we have break up of unit produced and break up of revenue for 2015 and 2016 first question which was the costliest model manufactured by maruti udyog limited in 2015 in 2015 so can i say if i'm looking for the costliest model i'm looking for per unit to per unit to selling price per unit selling price and per unit selling price will be given by revenue of a car by units produced of a car now let us do the work for maruti maruti i have 54 degrees which is 3 54 degrees out of 360 of 200 million by this is for maruti 800 this is for maruti 800 and on the left hand side we have 108 degrees by 360 degrees into 5000 this is the figure for maruti 800 Now remember, question five did not ask us. Did not ask us to calculate what that cost is. It is simply asking for the costliest model. So when I do it for Maruti eight hundred, and let's do it for Omni now. For Omni, it would be thirty six degree by three sixty degree into two hundred million, and the breakup of units produced Omni is where okay. Fifty-four degree by three sixty degree into five thousand. If I have to compare these two fractions, can you see this two hundred million is identical, so it has no bearing on comparison. This five thousand is com is identical, so it has no bearing on comparison. This three sixty and this three sixty has no bearing on comparison. So essentially, all we have to compare is all we have to compare is the central angle made in the right hand side. Pie chart divided by central angle made in the left hand side pie chart. Wherever we get the highest fraction, that has to be the answer. So, with that in mind, let us check Wagner. Wagner here is thirty six. Here is thirty six. So I get one. For ST, here is one forty four. Here is seventy two. So I get two. For Omni, here is thirty six. Here is fifty four. So I get two by three. And for Zen. Here is ninety. Here is ninety. So I get one. Simple comparison tells me Esteem is the costliest model manufactured by Maruti Udyog Limited in the year twenty fifty. Okay. Next, which was the cheapest model manufactured by Maruti Udyog Limited in the year twenty sixteen? If you understood question five, question sixteen, uh, question six would also be easy to understand. This time we are not looking for the greatest value of the fraction created. We are looking for the smallest value. Let's go. For Omni, it is eighteen divided by thirty-six, so half. For Maruti, eight hundred. It is fifty-four divided by seventy-two, so three by four. For Wagner, it is thirty-six divided by thirty-six, so one. And for Zen, Zen, it is seventy-two divided by one zero eight, so it is two by three. Which of these is the cheapest model? Answer is option A. Omni. That is all the work that was needed to be done. Next, which car generated the maximum revenue for Maruti Udyog Limited in the year twenty sixteen? Which car generated the maximum revenue for Maruti Udyog Limited in the year twenty sixteen? Now, wonderfully, what this is asking is in this last pie chart that you have, which segment has the greatest uh, share? Clearly, you can see esteem is half the revenue generated. So, esteem generated the maximum revenue for Madhuri Udyog Limited in the year twenty sixteen. Okay, next, from the year twenty fifteen to twenty sixteen, which car observed the maximum growth rate in terms of units produced? Okay, now, now, comparing fractions or comparing degrees would not work because now I would need to have precise values and everything done here. 
I would need precise values because the totals here are not comparable. Let's say we are doing it for ST. Let's say we are doing it for ST. So 72 by 360 into 5000 was the initial number. Final number was 108 by 360 into 7000. So the fraction that we would be dealing with is 7000 into 108 by 360 minus 72 by 360 into 5000 whole thing divided by 72 divided by 360 into 5000 in 200 this is the growth rate for st this is the growth rate for st now how we can because this is the growth rate for esteem how we take our work forward see this 100 is going to be identical regardless of what car you take so this is not useful for comparison we are left with this now even within this even within this can i break this up into two fractions 7000 into 108 by 360 by 72 by 360 into 5000 minus this and this are identical minus 1. When it comes to comparison, this one is also not useful for us because it is going to be identical everywhere. This 360 and 360 is also identical, so will not be useful. So can you see? The fraction that we are comparing or the fraction that we are essentially finally concerned with is going to be 7,000 by 5,000 or 7 by 5 into the central angle in the bottom figure divided by central angle in the upper figure. Wherever we get the highest fraction, that is the maximum growth rate. So let's do that for Zen. Zen, we have 108 here. We have 90 here. So 108 by 90 is 6 by 5. So you get 42 by 25 for Zen for Wagner. We have 7 by 5 into 36 by 36. So we get 7 by 5 only. Maruti 800. We have 72 by 108. So 7 by 5 into uh, 2 by 3 or 14 by 15. Okay. And finally, for esteem, we have 7 by 5 into how much? Uh, esteem. 108 divided by 72. 3 by 2. So this turns to 21 by 10. Now, among these fractions, among these fractions, we have to figure out which is the greatest fraction. Clearly, 21 by 10 is greater than 2. This is the greatest fraction. So answer has to be option D. In this beautiful set, three answers are ST. One answer is Omni. And that is the entirety of this set. You need to be comfortable with manipula uh, manipulating numbers and comparing fractions. That is the skill this question was testing. Mm -hmm.